Hello everyone, this is Crota giving you a shoutcast between AAA and EG. This is going to be AAA Benson versus EG, I think it's Ciara or Kiara. Um, I'll just say Ciara since it's easier to pronounce for myself. Anyways, this is game three of a best of seven series. Um, this is a triple A or this is a match game between EG and triple A. If you guys have not seen game games one and two, that, that was between um, Grubby and Montesu or Monster right now. We, anyways, over here on this map, this is Ancient Isle 2.0, Tree of Life, now producing an Altar of Elders and a Moonwell. So I'm expecting... Um, the look, the build looks to be Huntresses. No, there is a single Ancient of War being put down right next to this barracks right here. So it may not be Huntresses, but we'll see how this is really going to affect everything right now. Altar of Storms nearing completion. Orc Burrow nearing completion as well. The second Orc Burrow should be put right here in this position and start firing spears in just a second. So we'll see if Ciara really does that. That would be the pretty standard build coming in from Ciara right now. Unable to see how much wood he has. It needs an additional 20 wood finally. Blade Master now being produced. Meanwhile, Demon Hunter. Keeper of the Grove, wow. So AAA Benson going Keeper of the Grove and getting a lot of Wisp as well. So we'll see how this is really going to work. All those Wisps are pretty exposed. Excuse me, two Blade Master Harass. So I'm not quite sure what's going to happen there. That and Barracks is going to be completed in just a moment. And we'll see what's going to happen. Is that Ancient of War going to start beating up or is he going to start to uproot himself and try to take down that Orc Burrow? Probably... I would say take down that Orc Burrow is probably the smarter move at this point as that Orc Burrow is going to um, be, wreck a lot of problems right there. And if he can supply lock on Kiara, that would be very, very important. Oh, going after some pe peons instead. Going to eat a tree right now and then perhaps try to take down that Orc Burrow. And now we're going to take down that Orc Burrow, trying to take it down. No, just eating trees. So not quite sure what that's about. And now rooting himself. So he's now going to root himself and now take down that Orc Burrow. Going to um, have that um, fortified armor. So very, very nicely done. Orc Burrow down to 400 hit points. Needs to start getting repaired. No, not quite sure if now he's going after a single grunt. So not quite sure what's happening here. Going after that grunt and that um, Ancient of War still regenerating hit points as it is... Currently, um, still regenerating hit points. Now going after that single grunt once more. The Keeper of the Grove is going to be able to come in and entangle that grunt and get even get experience for that in just a second. So we'll see how that's going to work. Now trying to take down that Orc Burrow. Orc Burrow, and now comes in the Keeper of the Grove. Gets an entangle off on that grunt. That grunt's going to be not going to be long for life. And the Blade Master is going to try to come out and take down that grunt. Once more, the um, Ancient of War now going after that peon. Those peons quickly coming back off that line in order to prevent the Ancient of War from rooting himself. Now going to lose that grunt once more more the keeper of the grove gonna take down that grunt one two more hits it, oh needs one more hit down goes the grunt and now the ancient of war is once again trying to take down that orc bro so very very early harassment right there now coming in with this additional ancient of wars probably gonna get some um, um, huntresses in just a second kiara and um, being forced to um, really not produce any additional lumber right now as he needs to repair repair that orc burrow otherwise he's gonna get supply lock keeper of the grove coming back off the line We'll see if the Ancient of War is going to try to take down any of those units. Keeper of the Groves needs to come in and try to entangle some of those peons that are repairing that Orc Burrow to really, really make him pay right now. But that Blade Master doing a good job focusing that Keeper of the Grove away from that base. Once more, Ancient of War trying to take down any any units that he can, going, take, going after a single peon right now. And we're finally upgrading the Stronghold. Uh, now, once again, going to be uprooted, perhaps going to eat some additional trees. No wisps in, in anywhere nearby, so needs to try to get as many um, trees as he can. Is going to go down to that orc burrow, unfortunately, as that orc burrow has four peons in there, and the blade master probably got some um, got some experience off of that. Blade Master now sitting at level one, and now trying to run away. Uh, that very very bad position for that Blade Master. Blade Master very very low on hit points. Does have a Voodoo Lounge, but still sitting at 26 over 30 food. Very very low. Keeper of the Grove can be able to come in here. Yeah, he's gonna get a oh get an entangle off on that Keeper of the Grove. Gets an entangle off, and now that Blade Master very very low on hit points. Oh, the Keeper of the Grove um, does cannot hold on to the Blade Master just long enough. Keeper of the Grove should be able to get two or three peons. If he really, really wanted to, they're all so low on hit points right now. They're going to be forced to try to hide right there. Keeper of the Grove now getting entangled off on that, on that single um, uh, uh, peon grunt right there. And he kill, Kiara kills it himself in sort, order to prevent any experience. Keeper of the Grove going to once again come back in, get another entangle off peon, getting killed once more. Blade Master losing the healing once more. So um, Triple A Benson doing a great job in just keeping this harassment on, knowing the weak points of. 
of the orc army right now using that keeper of the grove like old school reign of chaos and and just just doing a lot of damage to these units now will he be able to take down that orc bro he may be able to get enough range on that orc bro to, to supply lock kiara and prevent the shadow hunter from coming out as we saw earlier and is he going to go after it not quite sure um keeper of the grove does not have enough mana though so now just trying to take down that voodoo lounge and now more huntresses joining in now well, it's only two huntresses quickly hiding blade map um, keeper of the grove trying to run around that map um, tree of ages now taking the tree of eternity are we going to see ancients of wind so let's see yes a ancient of lores so triple um, ancient of lores coming in so this is not going to be your typical night elf versus orc matchup i love this i hate seeing ancient of winds right now as it's just such a common tactic now the huntress is focusing down that voodoo lounge and a single low hit point huntress will have to be able to run to the back right there and a low hit point peon or a peon now being able to run back that range on that huntress just doesn't look like it looks more like it's melee runs more now we have a shadow hunter being trained blade master low on hit points we'll see if the keeper of the grove gonna get an entangle off gets an entangle off and already very very low on hit points gets two hits off before the blade master is going to be forced to run back to his base right now blade master has no way of healing right now so this is really really bad may be able to pick up some items from that voodoo lounge now once again going to pick up some healing salves and tr trying to run to the back of the base in order to heal able to heal getting an entangle off on a low hit point peon once more that peon taking damage over time going to get killed by his own friends wow i hate to be an orc right now backstabbing your friends like that and like orc bros and orc bros saying that there's 31 of our 40 food shadow hunter is going to be coming out in just a second and we have a demon hunter as a secondary hero ancient of lore is nearing completion and is where is that ancient of war ancient of war now coming out to do some perhaps some um, ancient of war creeping trying to head back to the north ancient Keeper of the Grove wants to get to level 2 as the Blade Master is um, nearing level 2 as well. Going to take down these Ogre Magi over here with that Shadow Hunter. Ancient of War quickly coming in and now doing some tanking. So very, very nice job from that Ancient of War. Um, way to use your hit points and absorb some of that damage. Now that Ogre Warrior going to fall. Keeper of the Grove may get, should get to level 2 off of this as long as he doesn't... Yeah, he did not get the kill. Um, the Keeper of the Grove did not get... Or the Ancient of War didn't get the kill. Keeper of the Grove just doing a great job harassing even though he has so little hit points. Now down goes the Ogre Magi, level 2, getting the Circuit of Nobility, Dryad is joining the army, and now we have the Shadow Hunter and the Blade Master moving back out. Grubby in a very, very precarious situation at this point in the game, as he has no idea what Benson is going for. He doesn't, I and mean, he has Wind Riders, so Wind Riders joining the army, so he probably thinks that there's going to be ancient of ancient of winds in order to try to counteract that army right now demon hunter now trying to do some additional creeping um, we have a keeper of the grove quickly get quickly taking some damage and now the keeper of the grove um, or the blade master once again trying to run back out there dual ancient of lore is no bear upgrade yet we are at tree of eternity a little bit surprised oh there's the bear training so bear train now underway. Demon hunter sitting at level one, and now and, and now perhaps we'll get some mana burns off. We'll see. I haven't. I don't know what the demon hunter has trained yet. Blade master still trying to run around that map. Ancient of war quickly sees him, and once again moves back out. Wind riders going to do some um, creeping over here. So blade master sitting at level two. Shadow hunter at level two. So level two, level two versus level two, level one. Keeper of the grove getting an entangle off on that troll berserker to prevent any additional piercing damage. Needs to and um, protect this army. This um, un armored army right there a null overseer getting dropped in sentry wards a perfect item being picked up um, for that demon hunter in order to counteract that blade master stay tuned for part two and the conclusion of this replay between triple a benson and ciara here on um, uh, what ancient isle 2.0 thanks for listening